People in this room are all part of a new club, but it's a group they'd rather not be a part of. It's a support group of sorts for those who've lost a loved one in law enforcement. We need somebody that knows exactly what you're going through to help you get through the dark days. The organization is new to families and colleagues of fallen police officers. Fox 43's Melissa Matthews joins us now to explain how the chapter will actually benefit the entire state. Melissa. Jamie, that's exactly right. The organization is called COPS, which is short for Concerns of Police Survivors. The goal is to help rebuild the lives of surviving family members and co-workers affected by an officer killed in the line of duty. Uh, Many gathering at the Life Team building on South Cameron Street in Harrisburg for the first meeting of the Central PA chapter of COPS. This chapter will assist those people in getting the help they need. COPS stands for Concerns of Police Survivors. There are no membership dues. For many, the price paid has already been too costly. When you lose, in my case, a son, you feel alone. You've lost a major part of yourself. Kim Wiggins' son, Sergeant Michael Wiggins Jr., was killed in the line of duty 17 months ago. An officer with the Lattimore Township Police Department in Adams County, Wiggins was escorting a charity motorcycle ride when his bike was hit by a truck. There's days that go by that I'm in denial that he's gone. I still expect to see him walk through the door. And then there's days where you hit that brick wall and you know they're not coming home. And people don't understand that. Survivors do. And that's where COPS comes in. Its mission is to offer support and much more to families and co-workers of officers killed in the line of duty from people who already have gone through the grieving process. You need somebody that knows exactly what you're going through to help you get through the dark days. They've never had to deal with that kind of loss before. It's, it's, uh, it's hard for them to know what to do and the right steps to take. Now, the Central PA chapter will cover 22 counties in our state. They'll help survivors with everything from financial aid, grief counseling, summer camps for spouses, parents, and co-workers. They'll even provide volunteers to go to court proceedings with family members. Certainly a great organization.